uh, area here. This is the parking area, this quarter here. Okay. And uh, when the, the car and the station gets connected, doors open. So this is your B3, third version of this so yes, battery exactly. swap station. Exactly. So we are actually right now uh, 16 stations open in Germany and a lot of other stations in Sweden and Norway and the Netherlands and so on. So, but we are uh, still uh, uh, growing. We are, uh, our infrastructure is growing, still growing. So, and um, yeah, the car is appearing here. It's okay. just uh, possible with a new, okay. or with a new brand. It's called Tempo. Tempo, it's a new brand. Uh, this is also a swappable car. Yes, yes, so you are parking in this area? Yes. And you push the button that you move the car. This will be the car. The car is parking at the back of the station. So when the car is at the station, the procedure, the swapping procedure starts. That one is exactly that means the gate. Yes. There's the And um, now the battery, the battery going to the right side to a buffer position. Yes. And meanwhile, there is a fully charged battery coming from this side and uh, going up to the to the left. Okay. And then, yeah, the same procedure the other way around. Okay, can we walk inside? Yes, of course. You can please be careful with the rollers here. It's okay. like you can slip on it. So the door below opens. And then from that side, a uh, fresh battery pack comes in and goes up. And so it's 100% still charge. No, it's uh, 91%. Okay. Because of the, yeah, it's more. Um, Reserve the battery health. Exactly. Okay. Because of the battery health, we don't uh, pull it till 100%. Exactly. Okay. Because it stressed the battery. Understand. So, yes, yes. How many batteries would a station have on average? Like five batteries. Um, yeah, the, there is storage for uh, 13 batteries. Oh, that's a lot, 13 batteries. Yes, but um, because of the demand, we don't fill it with full what? batteries. So with them, right now here, there's just four batteries. But if we open the station, we will increase it to okay. six, seven, eight. It depends on nice. the demand, how much customers we will get in the future in the station. From start to beginning, how long will you say the batteries swap? Um, from push the button in this area to uh, go out, it's around four, four minutes. Four minutes. Okay, that's pretty decent. Yes. Like yes. one is say the charge and the average range would be around 400 km, 500 km. It depends on the driver for yeah. sure, but I mean, I have a, a T7 yes. with a 100 kilowatt battery and I'm driving a lot highway and um, I'm 400 kilometers approximately. That's decent. One last question. So when the batteries, the depleted batteries in the car goes back in, is it DC or AC charging? It's DC charging. Okay. But it's still slow charging, it's not fast charging. Okay. I mean not uh, slow charging like the AC charge, yeah. but uh, it's uh, maximum 80 kilowatts. That's okay. That's, That's okay. okay. Yeah. So, but uh, it's not, it's also because of the battery health that we charge the battery more slow, not like uh, fast charging 300 kilowatts or something like this. So this also increased uh, the, the, life, um, the life of the battery. You know? okay. mm. Thank you so much for being watching. You're welcome. Uh, it was nice to meet you. Uh, our first time visiting a new power swap station. Now we can go to new old showrooms nearby in Germany. Let's drive a car. Maybe we can try four minutes go from a fresh 91% single charge battery, roughly about 400 kilometers range. Very, very cool experience here in Germany. Click subscribe. Stay updated to more videos on EVs. I'll be the same.